Oh man, when you burn their discs, don't get them too heated up because you know they'll fucking crack. So I set my brake off. So in order to remove my brake off, we already unloosened this right here with our wrench, baby. And then we're over here unscrewing it, you know? So you gotta unscrew the nut that goes onto your arbor arm. And then you gotta remove the disc and make sure it's not stuck. This shit pops and you don't cut your fingers with this one because if, if it reads blood or senses blood, don't do the same thing. Or catch the break and it'll pop, boom, bada bing, bada boom. So you got this release button right here. It's this lock mechanism. You gotta remove it. Let me see. We got it. So we removed it. And then we gotta remove our disc, our break. We gotta slide it out, it's connected with, what's it called? Wiring, all that connection shit that you remote your controls with. Anyways, we have an access panel on that side and we're gonna access it through there to pull it out. So I wanna show it, but what's it called? It doesn't really, I can't have my two hands because I removed this with two hands when I jank it off. I pre-removed it from the top and from the side, but it's, it's kind of hard. See, my finger got jammed, boom, boom, anyways. You gotta, what's it called, even it out. So you gotta jack out from here and jack out from there. Cause we finally got it out. Look at this thing, man. Look at this thing. They bring this disc in the top. So when the two pop, it sends the brake cartridge and the brake cartridge caught that shit at a semi-second of a second. I don't know. Anyways, and then it just disappeared. And that's what's the good thing about these saws that if it, if it's the, the, the this sense is this right here, you touching it, it automatically pops out, man. So every time that happens, we change one of these brand new. It just produces safety. It produces loss. It produces loss, but it produces safety for the people who might accidentally cut the damn fingers. So now that you see the brake goes like this. You see the connection? And it goes into those little holes and stuff like that. So, let's see if we can put it in. Mister, Mister, Mister. Hey, what's going on here, man? My bad, my bad. It goes like this. It goes in there. Get it in there. It goes here. And it goes connected. Connect. Come on, connect. Okay. That should connect it. And we put our keyhole. Remember the one in the beginning from the beginning? The lock. There you go. Remember? Remember. Also, saw stop provides this. That's the separation you need from this to sensor. Don't touch, that's good. Another thing you should do is what's it called? Lower your disc or so you can reset it before you start it up. Lowering it, let it click, raising it, or you can do it fast way, this way. Grab it, push on. See if it goes down with your force, and if it's locked, that means it's reset. It's locked. So we're ready to turn it on. It should stop blinking red, and it means it's ready. There you go. Now let's see how smooth it cuts with the brand new blade. 